Hey, Jose. Um, how concerned were you at the beginning of the week about your safety, your teammates' safety, and the possibility that you guys might not be able to play a game tonight? You know, it was a is a very uh, is a very uh, frustrating situation for for all of us. Especially, you know, we were we were in a, you know we have a mentality to play the game, and then unfortunately, um, this situation with uh, this particular team and. And uh, but w whatever it needs to be done in order to be safe, uh, I think health is, is is very important, and we understand that as a group. And uh, um, we're just doing what we can to stay healthy and, and follow a safety protocol every day. Rich Dubrov here up next. Go ahead, Rich. Uh, Jose, because you live in Miami, was your concern uh, higher than maybe the rest of your teammates? You know, it was. Um, it was definitely a, a big decision for me because I couldn't go home. I got to stay at the hotel. Um, and uh, but um, definitely Miami, it's it's, it's it's a hot spot right now. And uh, you know, but I think everybody in our team did a great job, uh, stay out of it and uh, and protect themselves. John Mioli, you're up next. Go ahead, John. Jose, obviously, it's early in this season but what did these two days off do for me to you guys you think from a baseball standpoint I don't know I guess we'll find out tonight but um but I don't think it's uh you know we'll be able to practice yesterday we'll be able to you know and hit and, and moving around and it's definitely you know different but uh I think it's benefit from some players at some level of someone need a break or 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 not good I don't know we'll find out tonight I guess Nathan Ruiz, you're up next. Go ahead, Nathan. Hey, Jose, you obviously already went through it in Boston, and then tonight is, is your guys' home opener. How strange of an experience is this to, given how many years you've played, you've played in front of crowds, to now go out there in these kind of strange circumstances? You know, it's very, very difficult. Very difficult. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, it's a, you know, it's going to take, uh, it's going to take an extra focus. It's going to take a, a, you know, you got to show you love for the game. Um, and that's what, uh, you know, I told these guys each and every day, and you know, and I said it on a meeting the other day, it's gonna take all of us in order, because I'm I don't feel good every day, and don't feel good every day. We gotta push each other's up and keep the energy high, and it's it's very difficult. But I think as a group, we gotta unite and and uh, and support one another through these tough times. Joe Treza, you're up next. Go ahead, Joe. Jose, you guys were originally supposed to be playing the Marlins tonight. Now you're facing Garrett Cole. Um, what's what's it like having to prepare for him in such a quick turnaround? It's just a baseball game. Um, you know, guys are they're in this team. They, they face him. I face him. It's just a baseball game, and we were we we're very happy, and I think we're very blessed to have a baseball game tonight, and and that's how we took it. John Mioli, you're up again. Go ahead, John. Jose, you said when you signed that you were hoping to lead by example. And you know, be be someone that this team can follow as they're trying to improve. Do you feel like your first weekend of regular season game showed showed what you can bring to the Orioles? I don't know. I hope so. Um, I I think uh, you know the the coaching staff and you know they're doing a great job or, or let the players beat their stuff and and um, you know I'm very happy and like I say I take it one day at a time and and doing everything I can to help this team and you know it's very fun to see young players like Rio like Austin you know going up there and compete and getting better each and every day and uh, I really love where we are. 